In today's video, we're going to be talking about how you can win more games in Madden 18. What's up, guys? My name is Cody, and in today's video, it's all about how you could win more games Under in Madden 18. And what I want to do in this video is simply talk a little down. bit about a concept that has really helped me once I embraced it, and that is consistency. So. Uh, what I mean by consistency Again, um, in terms of how it applies to that is every play should be the same start. Okay, so I mean, that's why I suggest to basically have one formation. So, for example, for me, it's a bunch wide. If you want to get access to the bunch wide, you can get it in the uh, premium membership, which is which you can find that in the, in the description. So. But the basic starting point should always be the same. So for me, every single play starts with this perspective from the bunch wide. It doesn't doesn't go from the bunch wide to a five wide to a single back. It starts. In the bunch of life, okay? Because of that, again. that in my opinion has helped me tremendously offensively. No gain um, there on the completion. Just everything. Uh, the starting point. I know I can really get a good taste of what the defense is doing. There because and he really looks like a wide receiver. That, that's just critical. Yeah, 230, 240 um, range. Yeah, the, the not, problem not for super most huge. people. Maybe not counted on to be that in my opinion, point of attack blocker most people that we know used to have play. in the good old days. What they but don't know how to do is they don't know how to play the game. You can make him a primary target, and that's a whole other shred of defense. As soon as, as soon as you play a real person, when you're playing a, a live user on the other side of the ball, there's so much more that goes into, like right there, um, what you just saw, the sack. So I can't, like there's no simulation for that. The fact that he block shedded in point one I mean, there's no, there's no way to simulate that in a practice setting. You, you can't. So what you have to this do is you have so to realize down, that the game is entirely different when you play far. against a real They're person a third as opposed to, here. you know, if you just sat and played against the computer all the time, you can pretty much predict exactly what they're doing. So, so anyways, that's why I'm saying to, to limit what you do on offense because be if you try to do everything, you're gonna, you're gonna find out real quickly that it's gonna be off the crossbar and out it's short. He couldn't get it there. It's no good. So I'm offensively, go um, in this first half. the big thing is to be consistent. So anyways, Arlington, what I want right to share with you is out. a couple of ways that you can do that. So I talk about it all the time, but I, I don't think I'm giving a lot of practical stuff. So the first practical step is to clearly limit your play calling. Like the plays that you call, make sure they're, they're purposeful. So what I like to say down. is well, I just did a video talking a about the top five they just plays. The right and they if they don't fit into that category, if they don't beat zone, they don't beat man, they don't beat the blitz, they're not a counter play. And they're not a power play, in my opinion. They, they really don't have a place in the because there's no and purpose. Um, clearly, to find purpose will help us simplify the play. Every play has to have a purpose. Otherwise, you're just calling money plays. A lot of people get beat crap. A lot of people get a lot of people crap for just running money plays. But the reality is, they actually run a lot more money plays than they try to themselves. And and it doesn't help anybody get better. Okay. Again, this is about you guys becoming better players at the game. They in the heavy um, set on that's another thing that a lot of you really get caught up play, in. But we have seen smack them talk, that drama, whatever you sure call enough, it, as opposed to the tight end out on that one. one of the things that I've learned a lot down. from Bill Belichick and the New England Patriots is this, uh, is this simple uh, idea of consistent on focus on the goal of the team. Let this go for Sanders. Sanders. And an for Belichick, the, the entire goal is the week at hand, the long ball, don't they? And, and he already so found his guy once, tried to give um, him another they're chance they're there, there didn't he? Yeah, he did, couldn't He's connect, but as you alluded to, he doesn't have a touchdown from earlier, trying to keep him this, in the rhythm. This specific week, okay? And now so the most people spread out. Would, would pay lip service to it, but they don't actually do it. Belichick actually does it, and that's what makes him one of the best of all time. Is his ability to do that, his ability to focus on what do I have to do this week to win? 
Okay. Good for and, and again, I think that, that list became shorter the more you asked that question. The so it just be consistent. Those are critical elements to be successful. I can't do those two things. Very difficult, especially in offense. Offense is really hard. I don't know if you guys have played this game much, but offense is really hard because they just get so much pressure so quickly on you. Um, by really doing nothing. I mean, it's, it's just a straight four down line and rush. But the four down line and rush this year is just, I mean, it just flies in. And there's not a whole lot that you can do. So to be able call. to score, and not to mention zone coverage is off the field. To go in half number one. Cover two, that stuff is really, really effective. So anyways, what I'm saying, it's not saying that to be the of the game. I'm just saying um, it's, it's really hard to, to score as I touched it. <laughs> but, but anyways, guys, as far as being consistent goes, one of the biggest things that I can tell you to do is sit and play your playbook. And defensively and offensively, it's really important. Make everything look the same. Everything should be the same. It has two things. First, it gives you the same look. It almost so had the feel of an the, the only thing that changes and right now they want to make sure they keep that the and carry it to the second half. Oftentimes, you know to kick this Oftentimes you'll force him to have to play the same formation the entire game as well. In my opinion, that's the best way to play this will be taken short. because everything looks the same. It's very hard to predict if you're going to do. Just about if I just came out randomly and hit the two for five to lay down, 90% chance I'm going to admit this. Already down two touchdowns here in the first half. Okay, this but if I come out and drive, doesn't it? Uh, it certainly nickel, does. Three and a lot every of single play, plays. We you don't know, know that, if I'm running right? the cross. You don't know if I'm not going to score number two, number two, and three, number four. Why don't I do it in the same way? If he comes out in whatever. Like this, very deep like into their here. script. He doesn't I know think if I'm post or if I'm going to generate some offense uh, on this drive. Yeah, at least three points get that zero off the board. Okay. So Give that's a critical time and a new set of downs. To and with just my four seconds team. left in this first half. By the way, this guy call. here is running I know most the 4 3 wide the line. Um, this is something that I think some. So people are starting to do something that you guys might want to look into is this uh, Y9 because they get really, really good animation. The Anyways, guys, I want to thank you for watching today's video. Again, if you want the offense or defense, check out the premium membership. We get that. I know we're down 14-0, but just stay watching. We'll come back and win this game. But anyways, guys, just want to encourage so you to keep in that we'll get going again want to win more games, to be consistent, three. and to be uh, focused on the mission. Most people don't stay consistent throughout the whole game. You have to continually 